Here is my solution for the black screen on desktop capture problem with OBS. What the secret is to enable OpenGL rendering. And the way that you do this is to take your OBS icon, wherever it is, right click on it and go open file location. And that will open up the OBS window, like that program files, OBS studio, bin 64 bit or you can go directly to that location if you know where it is. But yeah, anyway. You can then go File, Open Windows PowerShell, like that, and it will open a Windows PowerShell window in the directory that we are working with. You say dot backslash, which refers to this folder that we're in, not any other folder, obs64.exe space dash dash allow dash open GL. Now I'm already running but apparently you can run two at once, it doesn't seem to mind too much and I don't know if this will work. As you can see it currently has the black screen problem. You can see it flickering at the side there while it tries to turn on the display and it's not working. So there you go, file and settings and from advanced and then you change your renderer to OpenGL and then you go you see in red down here it says program must be restarted for these settings to take effect you go OK and then you close OBS and then you open it again and it's yeah that's okay launching that is when it opens up I now go Ta-da! A working, after a fashion, obviously wouldn't normally have the... And here is the um, OBS that's been recording this desktop session the whole time. I'm just going to turn that off again because it's quite eh, unsightly. And that's how you fix that problem. Uh, file, settings, and advanced, open GL.